Summer has just started and school districts across the state are working to fill positions, which of many have been vacant since the pandemic. During COVID, we had a, a, a very drastic change in the world of education. Keith Gamble is the president of the Indiana State Teachers Association. He says at the rate jobs are opening up, we could see permanent substitutes while districts tried to fill vacant positions. There are around 1,900 teacher vacancies in the state. It will have devastating effects for some of our schools. He says teachers are simply not coming back. Between the complaints of low pay and larger classrooms, many teachers are looking at other options. When you have a, an issue where you have more folks leaving the profession and fewer entering, that's where you come up with the deficit that we're seeing. He says many teachers are choosing to wait until a private school position opens up, which could give them more pay and smaller class sizes. Parents we talked to today say they're hoping things will change. I think if everyone sent their kids to public schools, the system would change. You know, if you had your Meridian Kessler parents sending their kids to IPS schools and neighborhood schools, I guarantee you the system would accommodate those parents because they have wealth, they have access, they have resources, they have social capital, they have things that matter. Officials say the need is not just for teachers. They need bus drivers, cafeteria workers, and custodial staff. If you want more information on those positions, you can visit the Indiana Department of Education. In Indianapolis, Levi Harvey, Fox 59 News. Levi, thank you.